Let's see what this is all about. I've got a. Uh, let's take the gnome one up. It's hilarious. Um, how do I find out where this nuke's hitting? Four seconds. Is it here? Oh, it's over there. Didn't even know that was part of this game. It said to leave the area, but I didn't even know what area it was. That's cool, though. Oh, that's added in. Is there like a... Oh, ha, that is cool. Does that mean that area is now not able to go in for a little while? Because that would also be a cool feature. Oh, oh, flipping it. Didn't know there would be uh, running zombies in this. Or oh, the Scorch, I think they are. Like any game, I guess, when you first start, you don't really know what's worth taking and what's not worth taking. You just kind of go around just looting everything. I'm impressed with it being... What is it? Six years on from when the first game came out? Uh, when this game came out. So that's definitely keeping up with the, the kind of gameplay. don't think it's necessarily like the smoothest of games. And it's a bit... Um, like I've got all the graphics on Ultra. And I don't know if that's a cause for it. It shouldn't be. Like my computer should be able to handle this. But it's just maybe how they've got where it's rendering from and stuff. Like distance rendering. But there's just certain aspects to it that I think they could have done a bit better. Like, um, I'm trying to build a camp. But it doesn't really give much information on how to do it. But that will all come apparent. So far though, I can see why it had such a big following. I can't believe that in all these years I've never actually played any of the Fallout, so it's definitely nice to be able to start getting stuck into one of them. I don't actually know how regularly I'll be having to come to this camp, so I wonder where I should actually place it. That would be a logical place. This looks big enough and open enough. Open enough for it. Right. Uh, let's have a look. Um, maybe not here then. It's annoying. I thought that was quite good. Right. Let's just do this. I don't even know what that is. All's fair. You can go proper, proper base buildery in this. So I feel like what I'm gonna do with the plan for this, uh, as in like this game and, and uh, what's next for it really for Tuesdays and stuff. I'm gonna spend some time in my spare time, kind of getting to grips, doing a lot of the basic kind of learning the game sort of things that you'd expect from any sort of new game and then hopefully come back and start doing some more um, what are they called like online interactions but we'll have to we'll have to see how it goes like, I, don't, I honestly am so lost with what I should and shouldn't be doing at this point. That it's probably best to do some bit more uh, kind of searching, a bit more learning of the game before playing again. Just because I think it will just play better in terms of. Won't be so boring to watch me just running around trying to work out what I'm doing. Um, and probably dying at this rate, to be fair. 
Um, it's kind of cool, all the like aspects that they've put into it. Uh, all the online. Quite hard to hit there. Right, that's another thing. No idea how do you heal. I think it was H actually, give me a second. Haha. -ha. Easy. I say easy, I've nearly died by some bugs. But, but yeah, what was I saying? Um, I think it'll be a lot, lot, lot more fun for people to watch once I've kind of got the gist of what, what the game's all about, what I'm meant to be doing. And then we'll go from there. Um, but initial kind of thoughts on the game is, yeah, it's brilliant. It's going to take me a little while to learn what I need to be doing. Um, but no, I'm looking forward to kind of seeing where this goes and like working out what the story is and what what online aspects there are as well. Because I know the other game is quite big with the online interactions and we can go from there. Yeah, it'll be good to be able to do some of these events with online players. I just don't want to be that <laughs> that person that um, said ends up being a nuisance, just getting in the way and just causing issues. Don't do it. Fun times ahead, I think. Oh, a lot of a lot of the games I've stated that I'll be playing are going to be huge. My like Elden Ring's a huge game. Fallout seems to be a pretty big game. They're all big open worlds, but that is absolutely fine. Just got to put in the time. Learn the ropes of it all. Different styles of play. That's going to be interesting. Um, but I'm sure it'll be fine. Look forward to it.